Okay, so we want to find the equation of the sphere with the diameter of these two points and note that these two points are on the endpoints of the diameter. So first we want to get the midpoint. So in order to get the midpoint, this is the equation for it. So we have x1 plus x2 divided by 2, y1 plus y2 divided by 2, and z1 plus z2 divided by 2. So we'll get negative 16 plus negative 2 divided by 2, negative 3 plus 3 divided by 2, and 5 plus 9 divided by 2. So then we'll end up with negative 9, 0, and 7 as our midpoint. Okay, um, then we need to find the radius. So in order to find the radius, this is our equation. Where point is x1 y1 and z1 and our midpoint is x2 y2 and z2 you can use any point i'm going to use q because it's easier it doesn't have as big as numbers um, so i'll use negative two three and five and then our midpoint we have our negative nine and zero and seven and so r is going to equal the square root of negative 2 minus negative 9 squared plus 0 squared plus 5 minus 7 squared. And that's going to equal l after you put it into your calculator r is equal to 62 square root. Um, so if you don't remember the equation of a spear, it is x minus x naught squared plus y minus y naught squared plus z minus z naught squared equals r squared where r is your radius your x naught y naught and z naught is your midpoint so our midpoint equals x naught y naught and z naught so then we end up with x plus nine squared plus y squared plus z minus seven squared equals, it's gonna be the square root of 62 squared, which is going to just equal 62. And that is going to be your final equation of the sphere given these two points of the endpoints of the di diameter.